When I first heard about the 51 Charlie MOS, I really didn't know too much about it. I thought what most people thought, which was, you know, just pushing around paper, looking at a contract, signing it, and moving on to the next thing. As a contract specialist, every day is different. One day I could be working on a construction contract down in Atterbury to getting gym equipment out here in the stout field to getting soldiers fed for a drill day to even buying huge concrete blocks for sling load training for helicopters. In 2018, I deployed with a team of five contract specialists to Kuwait and we were all given different tasks. My mission just happened to be combating trafficking in persons. So the reason for my mission was because all the contracts we had to administer overseas had a policy in place that required us to ensure that no offenses related to human trafficking were occurring. There was one instance where we found out some of the employees weren't being treated to standard. They were actually being held against their will and also their personal effects were being withheld. And when we found that out, it was right in the middle of the night. So my partner and I, because it was just a small team that was conducting this mission, went out to the man camp that they were at So the rewarding part of this job was that we were indeed actually able to help some of those individuals that were helping us. So coming back home, I'm definitely doing something different now, but I'm still a contract specialist. And I think that just goes to show that this job has so many different opportunities available for, for me. And I think I'll continue to keep doing it because it's one of those jobs that you just won't get bored of.